okay, later that same day, like an hour later. And I get a FedEx alert. It's like, oh, we dropped your pack. And I'm like, huh? Anyways, this, I'm not excited about this. There's a couple lots coming next week or tomorrow or Tuesday. This lot was $16. So it was like $21. No, $26 shipped with tax and everything. So whatever it is, it is. But I have like three lots coming. I think just three. This week. Oh, this broke. I can already see the broken beads. That's too bad because those are pretty beads. I will sell them separately. Um, and they were cheap too. Like one was 13 or maybe two. One was like 13. The, the bit, winning bid. I could see this J. Crew. Come to me, J. Crew. Um, and one was like thirteen ninety nine, just weird odd bids, and maybe the other one was twenty something. Anyways, I, for some reason I'm looking forward to those. These are this is this is this is. I feel so productive today. Oh my god! Look at that. It's not brulee, but it's gorge. She's a jekru. Um, God, I need a smaller tub because this is supposed to be a five pound lot, but I don't know. I feel like I'm going to get through it quick because there's this is just like a big, big lot of, I won't say the rest of that, um, and not necessarily, I don't know that, I think I just bid on it, who knows anymore with me, I'm, I'm crazy, I tell you, I'm crazy, and look at my eyebrows, they're not got the Groucho marks going, <laughs> because it's before, I did the forward facing video, and who gives a shit, but when I do this video, I was like, oh, let me put my lipstick on. And let me do my brows real quick. And I'm just in there like with the eyeshadow, like, and so it's total groucho. Um, this is fine. I'm not mad at it. I'm not like thrilled with it. But again, for me, $26 and that's what it was, you know, out the door. Uh, that's, yeah, I'm not going to, whatever, you know, but the lots, I mean, I'll just won't talk about it. And then the lots that are coming again, they were all cheap too. I love these beads. I feel like I get them. Well, yeah, there's a little bit of seaweed, but I'm going to be patient. Anyways, yeah, I, I'm not going to try and talk about... I'm going to try not to repeat myself, because I already did a video. I didn't do one for two days, and now I'm going to do ten. Just ten right now. No, not really, but two. This one and that one. I just like a thing like this. You'll always hear me say I like a thing like this. It's just pretty. What's not to like about it? I might show that to Miss Molly. I don't know. Uh, 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 uh. This is a ugly ass statement necklace. Hold on. Let me get its ugly ass out of here. <laughs> uh. I don't expect to find any silver in here, any sterling. It's just not that kind of lot. And no gold. How's everybody doing today? What's going on? It's so nice to wake up and feel healthy. I feel like I'm like high. Like it's a drug to be like, just feel like a normal human. This isn't the ugly ass statement. This is just a, should I just say we won't find sterling? I, let's see. Well, so we might find some sterling. You know, I didn't mean we for sure wouldn't. It's pretty, whether it's sterling or not. The only difference is if it's not sterling, I will throw it over there. I have a drawer full of gold tone and silver tone chains that I personally wear, or if there's like a pendant, I should show you. I don't want to get up. If there's, you know, some cat, whatever. Well, it's not magnetic, but I also don't see it being mort. Do I? No, I don't. Uh, well, I don't need to look at it for seven hours. I will just, I'll put it in a little guy. I forgot I had these. I need to get more at the Dollar Tree. Dollar Dollar Bill, yo. Oh, I love the divided ones. I didn't even realize that's what I got. Because I will take these. Now, I'm using it for this purpose now. But after that, I will, like, take, uh take put stuff in here and take it over to my photo booth and then bring it back and then 
And it's nice to have it sorted because sometimes it gets a tangly and you don't want it next to a whatever, a scratchy or what have you. So yeah, to be, uh, Sabina was just telling me about it. But that's what I mean. <laughs> She's, uh, she's a one-of-a-kind for taste. But, yeah, she just a little ticky-boom, and that's fine. We just agreed. Don't ask me. You have an eBay question? Call eBay. I'm not eBay, so don't ask me. And it's funny because I'm always, like, so eager to help. Because, you know, when I started eBay in 1997, 8? There was no nothing, as you guys know. It's like one of those old people, like, when I started eBay, we had to walk four miles in the rain. Geos, I've seen this before. I think it's a cheap brand. Geoska. Geoska. But anyways, literally, when I, when I started eBay, they took checks and money orders. <laughs> yeah, you can have a check or a money order. How funny is that? But there was nobody. There was nobody to help you. So now, whenever I have a friend or a person that's even if they're not a friend, you know, a quote friend, I'm always happy to help because I wish to heaven, God, I had the help. And you know, you can get a lot of ask questions answered. I think on YouTube and whatnot too. Nowadays, not then. Jesus, to unlock this. I just think this is fun. Joska. I've had a Yoska before. I don't recall what Yoska's. Like $20 maybe? Not sure. What's the Yoska? What in the Yoska is going on here? Let's get you out of here. Okay, this isn't Sterling, which is good to know, but it has a little tag. And what's he say? She says... This. A-E-O. Got an A-E-Q. Whatever. You know, when I don't can't know what a tag is, I wish it didn't even have one. Seriously, because ignorance is bliss. Like, not that it's... Whatever. Do you know what I mean? Like, if I didn't know... Okay, this is gonna... Okay, we are in a seaweed festival right here, right now. I like this. It's paparazzi. Oh, no, that's not paparazzi. Sorry. I like this. Then I saw a paparazzi card, but that was something else. Ugh, guys, what the hiney A. Hey. Well, this is well, these all too common peacock necklaces. That's not what I like. I like this. I just like a thing like this. I don't think it has a maker on it. Oh, well, I don't like untangling a thing like this. The multi strand of it all. It's nice and light. Doesn't feel cheap, but it feels. Oh my god. Oh well, getting closer. Look at that. It's happening. Like puzzles, things like that. Nope. No bueno. Not for me. Should I spend the time, you guys? Are you like tuned out yet? What is happening? And it's always like if somebody else that was good at this, they would have had this done like already ten minutes ago. I'm wearing this ring again. It does turn my finger green. I need to put clear polish in it, but... Okay, close enough. It's not, but it's close enough. It doesn't look worn. Let's see if that's an ingy. An ingy? No, it's just a kind of vintage -y, cool satellite. Right? Satellite. Satellite of love. It's a Lou Reed song. Velvet Underground. Yeah, I think it's Velvet Underground on the read. I don't know. Fold over clasp. I just like it. I think it's cool. I don't know if these are... Yeah, they're black. And... Okay, far too much time on it. I haven't quite got it. Quite got it. Quite got it straightened out. I feel rushed because it's seaweed. So I don't want to, you know, be here for six hours with y'all. Tiger Tiger Wood, y'all. There's another little gold black situate. Oh, probably the same maker, which is no maker. <laughs> right? <laughs> Fold over glass. Oh, no, this one actually has a maker, and it is 
Napier. And I listed that Crown Trafari, which I still haven't showed you. It's a nice one. It's There's no rhinestones, but it's a nice statement piece. I listed it for 150 I have one watcher. So that tells me, what that tells me is that the price isn't insane. Do you know what I mean? Because, like, say I put it at 400 or you know what I mean. If the price was, like, if 150 was like, what? You wouldn't even bother watching it. Oh, my God, I can't. So this is a Napier. Tone cross with little diamond accents that so wants to not let go. I think it's. Oh, I thought it was a -ball. Okay, I'm gonna put these aside right now because. Mm -hmm. Ew. I wonder if we'll find anything spectacular. Another cheap but pretty. Um, what do you call it? State necklace. It's lightweight. It's real, real cheap. So I wouldn't list it. I mean, look at how pretty it is. Am I right? But I just feel like if somebody might expect more weight. As pretty as it is, I should go over there. Yeah, here's what I thought why I would be fast. Because there's just a whole bunch of massive, like, I guess, statement necklaces in here that are just... Ugh. I don't know. Maybe I just bid on it because it was cheap? I guess I didn't see, because some lots that are coming in, there were some things I saw that's like, okay, I'm going to bid on this because I see these things. But these last few lots that I got from these, the seller was like, why did I bid? What? Huh? And one of, them, one of the lots was cheap because that gal that likes to just screw with people and bid shit up just, yeah, because it's fun. Made me pay $90 for a lot that I literally threw the whole thing in the trash. I'm not going to lie. I mean, not even lying. Um, it's okay. I'll put that aside to see if my older sister likes it. She is so opposite of me. I mean, I'll show her things that I, like that. I would show her that and she might say, like, it's really pretty, but it's just, it's too much. You know, like too aggressive or whatever. This is so pretty and I know it's just cheap, but I don't care and it's broken and I'm gonna fix it. Looks like an in, oh, no, 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 boo. Yeah, I did see the back of this one in the picture. Darn it. This is literally the reason I bid on it and it's just cheap, but gorgeous, uh, broken. And I could see part of the front and part of the back and it just seemed to twist on forever in the picture and I'm like, well, I need to see this whole thing in person. It's pretty. But I, yeah, I didn't, I mean, whatever, it's broken. Maybe I can fix it. Just like a, hold on. Are we done here? Is it, are, what? I can't tell where it broke off. God. Yeah, it's just a pretty... Oh, you'll see in a minute. You'll see the brokenness of it all. And you'll see why it was so hard to see in the picture. Because it's so... Like, they had it strung out into three different piles. I'm going to see if I can... Um, just when I thought it was free, something else snagged on it. Uh, let me see how it broke first. Well, it doesn't look like it broke there. I just saw another piece of this, so look at how pretty it is, though. And the back is all like, well, I mean, it's, it's all open. I could see that in the picture. I could not see this gorgeousness of it all, right? But what I could see was like that and that. But, uh, just, uh, hold on. Oh, dirty, dirty nose run. Not dirty nose run, but when something's dirty. Okay, you guys, what's happening? Did it... Is there another... I think there's another piece. Oh. Oh, maybe not. That just broke. No? Okay, so it's complete. Ish. 
Ah, oh, but it broke, broke. Let me see. Let me make sure it broke, broke. I'm trying to... Sorry, you guys. I just... I think it's so pretty. I'm trying to see what the other one is. Yeah, no. Yeah, it broke, broke. I mean, it could be welded. I don't know if a jeweler would do that. Is this a little dangling? Oh, that's so pretty. Like, that's not even like, oh, I can... I can't. I would have to take it somewhere. I just think it's gorgeous, you guys. Look at that. Right? Is it gorgeous? So at least I was right. It's a beautiful thing. I didn't see this whole part of it. I'm spending five hours on this. I didn't see that whole. I saw parts of it, like over here and sort of you know, a little bit more. Ah, oh, boo. That is a sadness. I mean, if my... I don't really have a jeweler. When I say my jeweler... My nose. And I don't... Okay. When I say my jeweler, I mean the jeweler that's closest to me. I don't have, a like, a friendly jeweler. Be like, oh, I'll just... You know, I normally charge... And it's just metal, so it's like... I don't even know if they'd work on it. It's just so pretty. You know what I mean? Oh, God. The bead's broken. Uh, okay. Let me try to get this fugly ug uggos out of here. See what else the fuggy uggy has hanging on. <laughs> Can we all just join hands and, and throw these all in a bonfire? Can we all just say that why... I forget who started these in the 50s and then J. Crew like re virgin, re, not re virgin. Okay. Re have, you know, whatever, like reissued them or copied them or whatever you want to say. And now it's just like every other shitty jeweler did it. And now we're just, you know, lousy with them. I don't like any of this. Ew. Oh, I might be able to. Release the seat. This chain needs to go off of the... Yeah, this is why I haven't been doing opening lots from the seller. Because should... that's broken. That should be broken because it's... Okay. Pretty sure. That's all poopy. She's all poopy. Oh, I mean, I'll maybe check it later if I feel like it. But I might not because... Mm, darn it. Darn that pretty necklace. That bums me out. And it's prettier than I thought. So it really bums me out. I wish I would have got it and it was just like not as pretty as I thought. And then broken. Okay, another... Um... Another no, really. Topi beige poopy no. Well, that J. Crew necklace is pretty... And again, twenty six dollars. I'm fine. And I always, what's happening? Oh, okay. Well, that wasn't that hard. Maybe it's just modern. It's boho hippie. You know, I I always I don't mind a thing like that. I do mind a thing like that. Yeah, there's not going to be anything good in this lot. I need to stop buying from this place. I was like, it's garbage. Garbage, I tell ya. Garbage. So why do I do it? Yeah, good question. This is sterling, because if it's not, I'm not even going to bother. Yeah. Um... Yeah, so Sabina was sending me a message about some phone charger. She's so random, but she has good, you know, whatever. Not instincts, but she'll be like, oh, you need to try this. And then I'm like, oh, cool. Because I don't know about you guys, but my iPhone can go to 80%, say. Let's just say, because I'm neurotic and I don't like to let it go down to, like, 60 ever. And I know everybody else is like, oh, shit, my charger's dead. I gotta plug it in. I'm like... Or my battery's dead, I gotta plug it in. I'm like, oh man, you guys are living on the edge. The edge. 
much, I tell you. So, say mine gets to 80%. Eh, with my charger, it will take two hours to charge 20%. So 10% an hour. And so then when she sent me that link, she's like, oh my God, I got I, I got these on Amazon. What are they called? Anchor something, power something. And they're not cheap, but she got some on Friday cyber thingy for 23 instead of like 33. God dang it. But yeah, I, it's not like something like, oh, I've been needing that, but I have been needing it because I'm so over it, you know, when I do need to, I spent way too long on unleashing this because it's just, it's too, it's too poopy. Ugh. Um, oh my god, we're not going to find anything in that lot. Just, just all one thing? That's weird. Well, I like it better now because it's weird. Yeah, that's all right. I just say I, like I'm 18. Do 18 year olds even say I anymore? <laughs> Uh, the worst is, and my husband does this, he'll say something, oh, what's the word? Not sick, because I think that's just so stupid. Okay, you'll, yeah, I don't know if you ever heard me say it. Hopefully you never do hear me say sick as in something's cool. You'll hear me say sick a lot. Like, I don't feel so good, I'm sick. This is just a bunch of shit. Um, dank. Oh, it's dank dank weed. It's like, really? Come on. I mean, he didn't invent it. I'm just saying, like, come on, kids. Take a vocabulary lesson. Learn some words. Do something with your life. <laughs> dank, dirty, dungeness room. Dank's not good. Don't try to flip it. Find a new word. Just make up a new word. Don't take the old words with the opposite meaning and flip them. God. Okay, this is... Well, maybe I'm not looking forward to the other lots that are coming. Oh, my God. This is such a bunch of garbage. It's garbage. Who did I just sound like? Oh, there's that AB. I mm, can't think of who I sound like. Probably nobody. <sighs> On this... Mm -mm. Well, maybe... Oops. Oh, you guys, I'm getting over it. I'm getting over it. I'm over it. And there's nothing, the only thing you hear clinking down there are the broken beads from the otherwise. I don't know what these beads are. They're, oh, I pick them up off the dirty broken ground. They're just, kind, yeah, I'll just toss them. They're just kind of a wood poo. I just keep pulling up the same pile of shit. I need to open the garbage bag. Okay. So I got like... And some people, like I was watching, um... Oh my god, what's her name? Lavender clothes on. Because she was doing a, a jewelry uh, thread up box. Bless her heart. She got a 10 karat gold like opal bracelet. Really cool. And it's her daughter who does... Well, she doesn't really do them. She just bought like 70 of the thread up boxes. And so this was her mom's first one. And she got so excited. And she's like, oh my God. Like she was like, I think I'm just going to start buying. And like all the comments are like, yeah, beginner's luck. <laughs> that's not a thing. Don't think that's like, that's the way she sounded was like, oh, so this, this could be like a thing. Just, we're just dealing with. Here, this thing should have just went out to their dumpster and um, opened it up and thrown this all in. I'm glad I wasn't expecting this one. For the love of whatever. Anyways. Yeah, and I know people get good thread up boxes, but like her daughter who's bought 70 of them, you know, yeah, like three have been great. Out of 70. <laughs> So, what was my point? Did I have a point? Well, yeah, it's a crapshoot. You get lucky. 
But thread up is, uh, you know, a little pricey. Because you only get like 15 items for like 60 shipped. Because it's like 45 plus shipping. So it's not cheap. So if you don't get some gold something, then you're screwed and you've not made any money. Or, you know, you've lost, thrown money out. Whereas at least the blue boxes are 30 shipped. So it's like, well, you know, it's not a big loss. Yeah, this is, this is a $25. I won't call it a loss because, well, ugh. I will break even. I, with those few necklaces I opened in the first place. That looks dirty, but I'll look better. Just, this is just all modern. I would say this is the worst lot I've gotten from them, but I got three more this weekend and they were all the worst. And they don't keep ordering. Trust me. It's like, well, why do you keep buying? No, these I bought a long time ago. They take forever to ship. But, and however, I am done. I have learned my lesson. I got a several good lots from them. You know, I don't, not just blindly stupid. I don't, you know what I mean? Like, I've gotten just, I have got a lot of lots, a good lots. This is so cheapy that I just don't think I can. I can't try to save it. I got red on my hand. Yeah, well, was it 2028 or 1928? I could tell I was trying to be Victorian, but I guess since it's 1928, I'd put it up for, you know, $10. It's pretty. It's just... Nothing worse than modern filthy jewelry. You know what I mean? If you're going to get filthy, could it at least be vintage? <laughs> I don't want to hear the trash. So this that may be sterling, and even if it is, folks, I don't know about y'all, but and this is fairly light. It's really pretty. It's a pretty thing. I would be lucky, lucky to get twenty dollars for this on eBay. I'm serious, and that's before fees. So that don't think that if that's sterling, they say, oh, that paid. Nope, sure didn't. Sure, Dad. Aunt. Look at my big old arm. I don't think this is even worth. I fucking hate Napier. Sorry. Oh, I'm cranky. Again, this just came as a total surprise. Like when I got a text, I'm like, "What? Who?" And I'm glad it was. Well, I'm not glad it was shitty. Yeah, this isn't worth untangling either. I'm just glad it was quick. I could tell. Because that's never, except for the Joan Rivers lot, and that wasn't from the seller. It's never good when you open like a five pound bag, which isn't that much, but when you open a five pound bag and it's like, oh, like this is going to be quick and in a hurry. It's not even 30 minutes. I'm done. I'm done with my dirty hands. I got to find my wipes. I think they fell down. Gosh dang it. Well, anyway, so that's, yeah, you don't want. That's not a thing you want. You want the lots that I got that I showed you in the light dot light box video where you have to spend five to seven hours going through it. And yeah, there was more. But I got 15 pounds from this seller the other day. Yeah, 15 pounds. Literally an hour. One hour to go through 15 pounds because it was all garbage. And then the other seller I got 15 pounds and one of five and the other, so 20. Five to seven hours to go through that. So five pounds more took me five hours more. But that's a good thing. That's not good because I can't take a video. But in this sad thing. So, so sad. Darn it all, man. And it reminds me of something. India. It's like India. Yeah, well, that was the reason I bid on the lot. And this is what I got. Boo. Not nice. Okay, I'm going to go because I was like in the groove of getting things listed and hustling and flowing and don't you know and yeah, that doesn't make sense. I got a hair in my eye. I can't touch my face. My hands are filthy. I'm going to go and I can do this with my long ass nail. Nope. Can't get the hair out. Oh my God. Okay. I'm going to go.